The tragedy in York County this morning is just one example of why doctors are asking you to think before you head to hospital emergency rooms. Yeah, hospitals are bracing for a sharp increase in visits from patients of all ages in the coming weeks. Penny, your side's Regina Mobley joins us with that story tonight. Regina? Well, citing federal rules, Riverside Health will not reveal any details about the patients who were treated following the horrific accident. Before the tragedy yesterday, an emergency room physician offered some advice for those unexpected visits to emergency rooms. It's been a lot. The volume's been high and people have been very sick. And many of the problems were caused by the unexpected. Early Friday, three people died and 22 were injured when a tractor trailer crashed into a party bus. Our trauma numbers climb throughout, have climbed throughout the year. They're definitely higher this year than they were last year. That's why doctors want you to use judgment before you head to the ER. So the emergency department is still the place we want people to come if they are injured if they have significant burns, if they have significant broken bones, or bleeding that won't stop for any stroke symptoms, any weakness or numbness on one side of the body or face, change in their speech, trouble with their balance, or sudden loss of their vision. Factors that contribute to so-called preventable ER visits include income, education, employment, health insurance coverage, transportation, and internet access. We're always a point of access for people who don't know where to seek care, and we're happy to be available for that. Regardless of your ability to pay, doctors say prevention is still the best medicine. Wash your hands, cover your cough and your sneeze. If you're not feeling well, stay home. People should consider vaccination for both influenza and coronavirus. Doctors say vaccines can be life-saving for people who are older or who have multiple medical conditions. So when should you treat your symptoms at home? I have those tips and more in this story on wavy.com. Regina Mobley, 10 on your side.